They're gonna run this set with randoms. Let's fucking go. Oh, hey, I wish Justin was here, because holy shit. <laughs> oh my god, it's a pit! It's a pit versus the Samus! What's happening? This isn't a mad pit pick. This is I a hate random this. pit. This is a random pit and a random Samus. What are we gonna see? Damn. I miss my boy already. He tell you all of Pitt's moves and why they're bad. <laughs> Alright, ooh, nice run up back air from a uh, Poncho. Really going for those aggressive options with Samus. You don't see that very often. I I just it's it's weird to watch him play. I I haven't seen him play Samus. Maybe he has in some of the brackets I haven't been around to commentate, but Oh my god. god, I forgot their name. Um, we had a Samus that played last time uh, a couple of brackets ago online. And they were like constantly moving. And that was so refreshing for me because it's, you know, an online bracket with Samus. So, yeah. No Wi-Fi Samus here. Right, and, oh, ooh, he parried the I first parried. hit and then he got that shield back out. Uh oh, here comes another forward air. Oh no, he's gonna disengage. Oh wow, he actually took advantage of the fact that hitting the projectile away puts some, uh, it kind of locks it down for a second. Yeah, really good there. Poncho built this. Terry is showing up in the way he plays Samus, and I think that's really right. Cool. I'm noticing that. Like his, his spacing and his aggressive options are fucking great with Samus. And like, it's Samus. Like, they have these tools, but I don't feel like Samus players capitalize enough with them. Uh, oh, oh, wow, he knocked him out of the FB. I'm going to tell Justin about that one. Damn. <laughs> Buff Samus DP. There we go. Safe Nair, safe Nair. Pit struggles to kill, so, uh, in a lot of ways, so it's a good... Yeah, getting those burst Rocky. options off stage definitely helps. Ooh, yep. See, wow, that, how'd that not hit? So I was like, I, I, uh, I clocked out for a second. What, what is happening? What is this? Um, right, this is fucked up. Harry. It's not, not Terry. Not, it's not Samus, Zero but... suit. <laughs> so YRC Gunflame, as it turns out, is a very good option. <laughs> you can walk behind it and follow up with a variety of moves. Uh, that's essentially what this has been from Poncho. And I love that. That shit feels nice. <laughs> Are we going to see Dragon Install Haha ha, Funny Move? <laughs> Close enough. Now, is you hear something funny about uh, Samus up tilt? What? It works. There's a hitbox behind it. Uh, oh, great. Yeah. yeah, Samus has cross up tools, and I think that's pretty rad. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even a jump. It's on, go it's on the ground. Oh, well, I guess you don't have to be on the air to cross up. Yeah. Yeah, it's an anti air. <laughs> And an overhead. Oh, fuck me. That's a... Uh, you know, <laughs> and I'm sorry, that... I'm so used to seeing that move specifically never work. That actually caught me off guard. What the fuck? <laughs> I thought Poncho would bounce up. Instead, they went down. I don't understand! <laughs> oh, back Justin would be very confused now. Oh, he, he thought he was going to fastball back down to re-engage. He was, like, getting ready to get that hard charge up smash. I can't tell if Justin would be mad or angry that there's a pit in finals. Well, he wasn't yeah, was playing pit to get. He wasn't. He didn't play pit to get here. Let's put it that way. Yeah. Yeah. No. Fair enough. Bomb shenanigans in neutral. Let's go. You love to see it. Ice bear. Ooh! Right, ooh! 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 Oh! That killed. I mean, it's Pit, like... Yeah, but that's different. I don't. Th I think the issues with Pit stem from his offense, not him dying early like that. Uh, I mean, okay, I definitely think that was just... I'm white, level 2 rage. <laughs> character that with a move that is not stale. <sighs> Shit, why would you drink vinegar dressing? <laughs> Oh, wow, they're really committing to the bit, huh? Um, I don't like that. We have Hellcare. Now I see why they said we are going to give you a set to remember. Are they just doing random? I, I think so. 
fucking assholes. <laughs> wow. You love to see it. Bro, I don't remember. Oh, he's gonna catch him. Bro, these little guys. These, these primary dudes? colors. <laughs> Why is there no green Pikmin yet? This is a serious question. We do not have a green Pikmin. Uh, is there hmm. not a green one? No, there isn't. Um, I guess not. I think we only have red, blue, yellow, purple, uh, black being the rock Pikmin, and um, fucking white. I guess it's so they contract. Hey guys, don't worry. I found a Google on on, uh, on Google. Is there a green Pikmin? Green Pikmin are the final type of Pikmin encountered in Pikmin, Sinister oh. Incinerator, and the fifth Pikmin encountered in Pikmin, the After Years. They are found above ground in the ancient wetland in Pikmin, Sinister Incinerator, in the Relentless Spring, and Pikmin, the After Years. Okay, From Green God. Pikmin, pick canon not! I only played Pikmin 2 as a kid, please forgive me. <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> no, these I are fake want... games, that's why. Oh uh, yeah, I have a feeling. Like, this is a bit, right? It sure is. Bro, I want RGB Olimar in Smash. <laughs> RGB Olimar. You're gonna have to- you're gonna have to settle for CMYK. Sorry. I don't wanna. <laughs> I don't that. wanna. Alright. Big, chunky, purple. What the fuck is this matchup? Bro, what is that? I I wish I could tell you. I'm I am rooting for Poncho just because I hate playing against Olimar. Um like a lot. That change in a minute? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice up smash. Hmm. I just don't like watching this. <laughs> it's so weird. Specifically because it's random or it's just all of our sets. <laughs> yeah, well, it's like we're going to have the longest grands of our lives. Yeah, I mean, hey, uh, Poncho has some momentum. Oh. And by some, okay. I mean, holy shit. Uh, level 3 Rage doesn't fuck around. Um, love to see it. So depending on how this next pick goes, you know, maybe, just maybe grands will be over. This was all staged. At the end, they're just going to get random uh, their mains. You know, it'd be really funny if that happened. Because I think the last <laughs> random bracket we did... Okay, I'm going to hate watching this. I'm sorry. Oh this my god, yellow... Cloud and Pac-Man, <laughs> kill me! This yellow fucker right here? Hate him. Yeah? Hate yeah. him so much. Holy shit. I hate him. I fucking hate him, too. Bro, his aerials are so fucking annoying. Uh, he doesn't have to approach. <laughs> Ugh. Like if you want to, if you if you see me in bracket and you want to tilt me, just play Pac Man. Like that, that's all you need to do. Character just he really doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, Th I think that's what it is. Pac Man as a character truly is out of every character in the roster. He is the most I don't give a fuck character. He just throws his little <laughs> shit down and says, "Yeah, deal with it." I don't care. That's your mean, problem so now. Happy. And if it somehow I, isn't your problem, I'll grab it out of the air and make it your problem again. Pac-Man is the Jacko of Smash Brothers. Oh, so you mean uh, as Leon Massey <laughs> put it, the uh, the summoning nexus from League of Legends? Yeah. Yes, absolutely, yes. <laughs> I'll, I got Galaga's, I got Keys, and I got Fruit and a Fire Hydrant. And he's also the Rush Down, I guess. Those. Yeah, how the fuck do you make a Rush Down Zoner? <laughs> Ah, but I don't like hearing that. That's not true. Those aren't real things. You can't have a rush down zoner. Fuck you. He can do both though. <laughs> and it's so fun. It's like a Eggs are be like. Oh, thank God he killed the fucking ball. You know what? I, Wait, there I, is I'm a sorry. rush down zoner. I'm I'm an idiot. The rush down zoner is Raven. Yeah. He zones you with needle and then he rushes you down at all times. If you slip once, if he gets one knockdown, he's like, I I'm in, boys.
Where is your um, Okizeme now? Like, imagine if Axel could hit you full screen, and if he did, he's like, okay, I am now in, and I'm, like, worse than Soul Bad Guy. I'm going to DP you. <laughs> I am going to DP you. Oh, he's got Liban, and he's got a fucking bird already! Jesus Why did he yeah. still have his stock? Listen, it's that five ninety nine smash port. Never mind. Fuck off. That worked. <laughs> that worked. Oh no, god. No, because he's not five ninety nine anymore. That's why he's not the same. I played Smash Three Days the other day. Cloud is dumb. It's so funny. I can't believe we lived like that. We really just play what we can. <laughs> Remember when his wrist was fucking broken every time he did his nair? Yeah. Because they, they just retargeted the rig. They said, all right, take that animation and move it to the elbow instead of the wrist. Oh, for Ryu's right ultimate. now is 2-0. I don't like how Ryu's foot looks doing anything. Wait, I don't... It's not... Shoot. Oh, yeah, is it? Uh, Poncho, Poncho won two games. Like, this is uh, Adrian Yogi's tournament stock if they lose. Well, is no, it? Poncho's coming from losers. So this is like... Reset. This is the reset, yeah. That's that's Adrian Yogi. Yeah, pretty sure he did. Wasn't he Olimar? Yeah, you said you weren't rooting for Poncho because he was Olimar. That's I'm my context. My fucking mind. Yeah, this is why you don't have. No, no, no. See, this is what I'm saying. Is it's like I'm taking that. I'm taking that. I'm realizing. Well, if you said you didn't want to root for Poncho because he was Olimar, that's our context clue. That's our. That's that's the ticket. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, yeah, this is this is also true. Um, all right. Thank you. I thought I was losing my fucking mind. <laughs> oh my god. Smash <laughs> GG. Please. What is this? Uh, all right, never mind. I, I, I it's, oh god, I hate this blue little fucker. Nah. How do you make one of my wow. favorite video game characters the most boring character in the game? I literally forget Sonic. Sometimes. I hate this. First, um, you get Pac Man. They kill Pac Man. I gotta bring the next one in. <laughs> this truly is the Wi Fi game, huh? Yeah. Kill me. Oh man, this is a. Yikes. Bro, Sonic is so fucking frustrating, man. Why they gotta make three of the specials the fucking same? <laughs> God help me. Man, it really is looking to be the uh, the the two for two, and then the final set. They're made. Shit's fucked, man. Like shit is absolutely fucked. Like I I commend them for getting to the bit, but like I I hate this. Like this specifically. <laughs> <laughs> this is just upsetting. Wow. <laughs> You know what? He had the lead. <laughs> just I, I don't feel time. bad right now. It's fucked it's up. Like it's friendly. Yo, I love Evo 2015. The most cursed set on my. <gasps> wow. Wow. <laughs> okay. I feel like it'd be funnier if they both went Bayonetta. But no one wants to remember that cursed ass set. Like don't, don't make me think about that again. Featuring redacted. It's just, it's a little, it's tough to commentate this because, and I, you know what, actually, though, this should, our commentary should be on point, actually. You know why? This should be a test of our commentary. You know what? <laughs> so I'm going to say you're that. Not, you're not wrong, but I will not deny, part of me is just a little upset right now. <laughs> Oh, you want to talk about being upset? How about the edge of Sonic's forward and killing it that fast? Oh, I would have yeah, expected you know, a little more drag. I can't believe like the, the just like an obscure hit from it just killed that easily. I know Mewtwo was sitting at like absurd percent, but still. Hitboxes.exe. We, 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 you know. No, we jumps a lot with Sonic, but it's like just just use, yeah, do that. Do that more. Don't jump you, as much. You just do that. Tools. Oh, you're dead. You know, it's weird. Oh, you know, it's weird. I feel like, I feel like as soon as you're commentary picked up the game also picked up maybe we're inspiring them yeah. but like i think it's funny because it's like I, how, how does this, is like mewtwo i feel like mewtwo sucks at this matchup but he also does have the disjoint like 
I feel like if the disjoint works in Bluetooth's favor, he can shut down a lot of Sonic's options. But yeah, absolutely. I mean, this is it, this is it takes it's it's all about precision though. It's like how like Ridley isn't stellar, but he does have access to like spaced normals with like tilts and stuff like that. That if you do it correctly, but at our level, how consistent is correctly without like making you want to kill yourself? Okay, yeah, he's gonna poke him with an up smash every single time because he jumping. Like I said, what kind of shoes he wearing? In his <laughs> casket, he's wearing the soap shoes in his casket. I'm calling it. Oh my god. God. Sonic Adventure 2, baby! Yo, Joey, hear me out. I have an idea. Next yeah. Tiamat, next in person bracket, we just pull up the soap juice and start it. grinding on rails and shit. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Alright, it's a reset. Are they gonna keep using random? I mean, fuck it, have fun with it, right? Oh, my God, how do I even report this set? <laughs> Praise be the Ganny sauce. Yeah, yeah, Matt, you fucking tell him. Damn, I haven't seen that daddy in years. Yeah, Matt, their their whole set's been completely random. Right. <laughs> Ozers is not very happy. <laughs> oh my I fucking have to watch god! And Sonic and Mewtwo. You know what? They weren't wrong. This is definitely a set we'll remember forever. But like, holy shit! I I thought they. <laughs> Damn. Can you, can you guys complete the set for us? <laughs> Play an explosive character then. Play a character that's all or nothing. Play Puff. I promise you that game will go fast. Don't play Timeout Puff. Play Aggressive Puff, it will go fast. You know what? Fuck it. Play Ganondorf. Yeah. Yeah. Make a statement. Play Ganondorf. Hate yourself. Play Ganondorf. Platinum the Trinity. Matt in the chat. Play Ganon, cowards. <laughs> Yo, you know about the puff pit. Oh my god. Platinum the Trinity. You can't! She's not in the game! She's not even a BB tag, is she? I think she is. Took them long enough. Fuckers. Too bad I'll never play BB tag ever again. <laughs> Ooh, games. Finished the set for them. Uh, they want us to do that. Oh, you mean that's what you wanted? Oh, you wanted us to go into the... Yes, I will do that for you guys. I will do that for you guys. Thank you, Joey. All right, Grand Finals reset. Are we going to see their actual characters? I would honestly like uh that, because it's been a while since I've seen a ZSS in any sort of finals. It's actually G acting up. Thank you, Woosie. Because mm. no one's got him. Just want, I, I just want their characters. I want to see some cool Terry shit, please. I have received a message. Who could it be? It's Miss Phoebe. All right. I don't even know what to say. I just don't know what to expect. Like, this is fucked. Like, I swear to God. They, they ran grands for the reset completely random. I don't know how to feel about this. <laughs> Kill me! <laughs>
Yeah, Joey, I think that's I just want to play Joey! <laughs> Yo, Twee Game's good. Game's so fucking good. Oh my I've god. Seen, I've seen some some crazy perspective shit when you walk around. Oh, we got some based Phoebe content in chat. No, I don't want really to go on Twitch. I'm gonna go on Twitter. Let me open my tweet deck, you fucker. I can't. I say this a million times. Still can't get over when Terry, um, the way he enters the stage, he just fucking jumps in from okay. nowhere. Yeah. Lucy, yeah. can you wiggle controller? All right. Yeah. No. This is, this is what I like to see. What this the shit. fuck? Yeah, He's already right. dead. Wow. Yeah. Right. All Andrew, right, Marvis, I see you. You gonna jump against me? You gonna be off stage against me? He's, yeah, he's not. He's not scared to still go back off stage though. He's like, I'm a fuck it. If you try to downbeat your way into the air, I will be there to spike you. Yeah, this this is this is the value of the end matchup. I want. You can't really like scare Poncho is the Whack thing. Your combo? Oh, you okay. can do that though. Oh. Watch him switch to Kazuya after this game. Even if he All wins right, this game, he'll it. switch to Kazuya. He'll be like, you know what? Fuck this. I want jumps. Yeah, no, bro. I, I'm feeling it right now. Holy shit. This is not a fun place to be in. All right. I think this is the most I've seen Poncho in their shield. Like, ever. All right. How are they going to come back? Because ZSS has that funny get out of disadvantage button that everyone loves to see. Nice following up there. Not following up. Ooh. I feel like we were going to see down tilt into up tilt in the power geyser. That up smash connecting is really bad. Poncho's in a significant deficit now. Like much worse than before. Oh my god, nearly holding on to that stock? Fucked up. That's Here like comes! PI, man. This is gonna go a lot faster now. This is much faster games. Yeah, absolutely. Ooh, Taking ooh. the game seriously? Alright, I can't watch Poncho get three stocked though. Come on. Bro, what happened? No JV. Happened? Wait, I looked away and the second stock was gone. What happened? Yeah, Yogi's been running around. Oh, he knew that side he was coming out to. He's like, yeah, jump up and down air. It's his, it's his movement. It's like what you talked about before. Movement. Absurd. Um, yeah, just every time Pontus tried to commit to an option, you know, he's just been super evasive and non-committal. Again, it's also one of those situations where I imagine um, it's, it's just player knowledge. Yeah, like they 100%. Both know each other super well, so it's like I know how to deal with you specifically. That's why they're going random. Oh my god, he caught him out of that. Go sauce is real though. Like, <laughs> make a mistake and get the power dunk. Oh, not the power dunk. Sorry, the power power geyser. Then fucked up shit can happen. It's like it's such a fucking comeback mechanic, bro. Imagine if Little Mac could throw out KO punches for free at like if he was at like 150. I say 150 because I just feel like, you know, KO Punch is a lot stronger than Power Geyser, but it also doesn't hit the entire tri-state area, so what do yeah. I know? I mean, wow, look at that movement! Holding up, he's bare he was making sure to approach and shield, and that was some FGC shit. Oh, there it is! All right, all right, Bust a wolf. Ooh. Ooh. Yo, Poncho that is hell! Yogi's waiting for that roll. Poncho losing that game one. Hmm. Thank you to Buzz. Thank you for posting which characters need a buff. What a fucked game. Like, holy shit. So we do those interactions, Poncho either just lost outright or Yogi just didn't care and just said, I'm gonna walk away from you.
Joey, I think you're right. I think I think Kazia is the way. Kazia is the sauce. Having having vertical options, let's fucking go. Like that that shit I can jump and recover consistently. Love that. Oh man! He's trying to run the FGC circuit! I'm gonna see Ryu next! <laughs> Purple Ken. Oh damn, that's not violent Ken. I can't make the Mr. Worldwide joke now. Fuck me. Oh, he's got all these tosses out. He's gonna have the Lavender Lariat. Damn. Damn, let's fucking go. See, there it is! Aerial Tatsus are my friend. Oh, he's got the movement down. Oh, he wants to. That's why he wants to match Zero Suit's movement. That's cool. Hmm. Yeah, you said those Tatsus, man, coming in. You like that frame four down tilt, my boy? Oh, boy. Damn. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, he likes this movement. He feels a lot more comfortable with this. It's a, it's a much more even setup. And the use of focus attacks will actually let him absorb enough hits that he can actually aggress on a lot of Zero Suit's uh, single hit lockdown options. It's like, yeah, you're neutral. Be fuck that shit. I don't care. Yeah, having the ability to just straight up ignore certain options um, while maintaining like high mobility definitely feel like that is preferred to just having strong options at uh, high percents. Go source as a resource, pretty nice, but I also just like being able to move around consistently. Hmm. I will say that it is tragic seeing uh Poncho getting shut down in the air from uh ZSS Nair. Not Nair, I mean fair. All right, pop thing again with the focus attack. Not getting anything major, but like he's getting those straight hits in, which I feel like is going to matter more in the long run. I was watching with the last game and stuff like that. This exact time about five eleven, that was uh, uh, three to one stocks. Now it's two to two, so it was a much more even pace, which yeah. is very satisfying to watch. Yeah, he's going for all these pokes now, and stuff like that. I want to see like more. I, I'm not seeing really like any Hadoukens. Well, I, well, there it is now, but yeah, and I mean, no, you, you're definitely right. Like I think this is the second or third one I've seen this whole match. <laughs> Oh, great focus attack. That almost killed on its own. Christ. I'm actually Jesus. amazed he didn't just do shit. Uh, Honestly, right after that. I mean, he really expected that to kill, to be fair. Like, that was definitely what was going on there. If Ponjo can just get those straight hits in, I, I think that's what's going to determine this match. Well, it's a nickel and dime. And then you get that one good uh, kill move from Ken, which Ken has access to. I mean, he's definitely uh, he's playing the field in terms of spacing, and it's really like, interesting to watch how he's very comfortable with Ken's movement speed. Like, look at that. See, as soon as he's there, he's like, all right, I'll smash. Now he's running around with rage, and now he's going to keep the pressure going on. He's going to stay up close. He's going to stay shielding low because it's going to make sure that he's not actually going to lose that stock lead. Because it's very, very easy for him to lose that, but he's going to want to make that rage do all that nickel down we were just talking about. Surprised I'm still not seeing Hadokens to actually close the gap a couple times. But to be fair, there's not many gaps that are opening up because he's making sure not to give uh, yeah, hey, Adrian Yogi. space to breathe. Yeah, Yogi is But, oh, good though. toss. So he's going to make sure that you actually can't get that, uh, that side B out. And see, yeah, he's just making sure he's always in the same zip code as this motherfucker. He's like, all right, I see you going down. Let me make sure my focus attack keeps my momentum. I'm going to stay in your face. You're going to be fishing for these side bees and your nares and whatnot. But here I am. I'm still holding on to the stock. 130, crazy rage. No hits are really, like, exchanging at all, though. They're so, this is, this is, like, dare I say Tekken with the spacing? Oh, there it is. Wow. All right. Even, it's very even now. Oh, my God. We got three minutes left, too. Uh, it's taking a lot longer. It's a long. It's gonna be a long ass grand, baby. Yeah, Yogi's just bobbing and weaving right now. Um, yeah, I mean that's the way to play this right now. Uh, Ken still, even if Ken has more movement speed than say Terry, he still doesn't have what Zero Suit has. So Yogi's response is to be like, all right, I just gotta take what is my advantage state. I gotta dial it up because if Ken can keep up a bit more than Terry, that's great and all, but he's still not the same. So uh, he's not. He doesn't have to change his game plan too much. He just has to make sure. That he's really advertising those strengths that Zero Suit has over Ken's uh, increasing speed. That's scary though, because again, Ken in your face, this man can <laughs> he's making combo the fuck out of you at low percent. 
But you know what Justin says, you know, like, uh, Zero Suit can kill you at 30 or 140. Uh, and right now it's in that weird south spot, but, um, uh, really good on that down air. Ooh, that up air, that outside is actually get enough hits to get through the armor. And are we going for, I was expecting, actually, I thought a downbeat was coming. Oh, he's going to whiff on that short. He's going to take the punish for it. Oh, all right, get Baron. He's going to go for the up smash, and that's not going to kill him? God, yeah, this character doesn't work. Concho's Ooh. in a very dangerous place right now. They, he's they expecting like, a jump. They get something significant right now. They yep, and he's going to whip that short you, and oh, good time using that jump to try to actually take advantage uh, of how much more space that would give him to breathe. Because you know, uh, Yogi's down there with an up smash. He's waiting to poke him in the air at any point just to kill him. Ooh. Finish that stock. Sit at 147. It's really going to happen fast. Oh my god, right. he's still alive. He's, he's going to just narrowly miss that. Oh, and he's going to take his time to get back on stage. Watch some fucked up Shoryu shit happen. Oh, no, the shield poke's oh, going to kill him. Yeah. Oh, yeah there it is. is. Adrian Yogi showing us why they still play this character. Definitely still viable. And are you gonna switch to Kaz? I never, I never expected Poncho like to have to nickel and dime a set. I'm just so used to seeing him like just consistently be moving and being aggressive and just blowing up the opponent. I, I did like the pace of that match a lot more, though. He was really in uh, Yogi's face the entire time. Yeah. Which is funny, because Ken has the tools to zone you out, too, you know? It's just weird seeing him be on the opposite end, you know? Round three. So already seeing those cheeky little ladder combos from Yogi. Yeah, again, uh, Yogi's just really bobbing and weaving in, not committing to any option, uh, keeping Poncho out. Poncho's definitely someone you don't want in your face. Uh, seeing as how they have all these good burst options and just consistent ways of damage. Ooh. Nice meaty hit from Poncho. Um, however, it does not make up for the deficit he's in right now. Will he be able to take advantage of that go sauce? Um, the question is, uh, with all this jumping around, he, I really expect him to actually do that. And he's going to fucking lose it. Oh, even though he's heavy too. Damn, unfortunate. That was the time, too, because with the amount that Yogi's know, doing the jumps and the, and the Mario, he go, jump, he sure do. Like, I that's asking like, for a power geyser. Yeah. I think that was the point, though. I think Yogi wanted to bait that out. I'd love to hear, if he wins this game, I'd love to hear, like, in the post-game interview, like, what his answer to that situation is. Like, if you're trying to bait it. Oh, my God! No! Boncho dropped the stock at 16? Unfortunate. That, that... Oh, fuck. That's gotta hurt. We're really in a situation right now. What do you do? This is your tournament stop. Wait, what the fuck happened? Uh, Poncho <laughs> SD'd at like 16 by accident. Uh. And they were already disadvantaged, so I have no idea how they're going to come back from this. Um. He could, which is fucked up. He could. Absolutely. There he hits his man. I feel God, like if, Yogi is accounted for Poncho's playstyle and just... Um, right, he's got the download at this character. point. Yeah. Like, it's definitely not free, but I feel like Yogi's yeah, game plan is secure. There it is. Didn't even drop the stock. Yeah. Very unfortunate from Poncho.